Look up at the night sky, right next door to us. A reddish dot hangs in the darkness. Mars. Today, it's a frigid, barren world. A vast desert that covers the entire planet's surface. But let's rewind time, billions of years into the past. Mars was a very different place then. Scientific evidence suggests a once warm and wet Mars, with a much thicker atmosphere. Liquid water flowed freely across its surface, forming ancient rivers, lakes, and perhaps even fast oceans. So what happened? What turned a potentially habitable world into a dead and desolate desert? This is the incredible story of the most extreme climate change in our entire solar system. In its early formation, Mars and Earth shared some surprising similarities. Both had atmospheres rich in carbon dioxide, with temperatures much warmer than they are today. Volcanoes were highly active, spewing lava and gases into the atmosphere. Water, likely delivered by icy asteroids, accumulated on the surface. Evidence of ancient riverbeds and dried up lake beds is still visible on the Martian surface today. Minerals discovered by our robotic rovers also confirm the presence of liquid water in its distant past. However, Mars had one fatal flaw compared to Earth, its much smaller size. This meant Mars's core cooled down much faster, weakening the planet's protective magnetic field. Earth's magnetic field acts as a crucial shield, protecting its atmosphere from destructive solar wind. As Mars's magnetic field faded, the powerful solar wind stripped away its fragile atmosphere. The carbon dioxide gas, the main component for trapping heat, was gradually blown out into space. Mars's surface temperature began to plummet, and all of its liquid water froze solid. Another factor contributing to Mars's desiccation was its weakening geological activity with a cold core. Its volcanoes stopped erupting, no longer replenishing the lost atmospheric gases. Any remaining water slowly froze beneath the surface or evaporated into the thinning atmosphere. The atmospheric pressure became too low for liquid water to exist stably on the surface. Ultraviolet light from the sun, now unfiltered, broke down any remaining water molecules. Mars slowly became a colossal snowball, a cold, dry, and lifeless desert. Yet, the story of Mars isn't entirely over. The traces of its watery past are still there. Scientists believe vast amounts of water ice still exist beneath the surface especially at the polar regions. It's possible that under specific conditions, liquid water could still exist deep below. By studying Mars's past, we gain a deeper understanding of how planets evolve and ultimately perish. It also gives us valuable insight into the critical importance of a magnetic field and geological activity for life. Mars, once a potentially habitable world, stands as a stark warning about planetary climate change but at the same time, it remains a compelling and fascinating destination for future human exploration and colonization.